example, you'll go to your email. In your email, you will see two messages from Jamaica Reads. One is simply thanking you for joining, for signing up. The other, website login information. Click on website login information. In this email, there are there are there is one link. This is your email that you had used. And now this is your link. It says password setup link. Click here to create your password. Click here to create your password. So you'll click there. Now, what do you want to use as your password? Whatever it is, type it in. Make sure you remember it. Click on I agree to the terms of service and privacy policy. Click on save password. After you click here, you must agree. Then save password. Now your password is saved. Back to login. Because now you need to log in to the platform. So now we're going to enter your email address, the email address that you used to sign up. That's the one you enter and the password that you had created as well. Make sure you remember it. I hope I remember mine. I am using a public or shared computer. I am not. Not a public computer, so I don't check this box. I ignore it and I click login. Good. I did remember my password. Now I am in. This is my student portal. And now in my student portal, I can see different things. I can go to home. Well, I'm already home. And I would normally see information here. Maybe my classes. If I had already had classes, I wouldn't. I just signed up. And I can now see the options I have. I can change my contact info. If I click here, I can view my calendar, which would be for my classes, a lending library, online resources, the study log, account and invoices, which will show my balances if I owe money to Jamaica Reads or if I've paid and my balances are clear. After I have my classes, my teachers will send me notes and the video to my class. So I'd come here at attendance and notes to view them. And maybe if there are any news from Jamaica Reads, I can see them here, as well as my message history. So I want to see my message history. So I clicked on that. And these were the two messages I had received. Website login information and sign up confirmation. And it says they were sent, which yes, I saw them in my Gmail account. So when it's time for my class, I will come back here and I will see all my classes scheduled here, or I can see them on my calendar. And that's how you register for programs at Jamaica Reads. Thank you.